everybody. This is Trevor Truck ASMR. And today we're playing Kirby 64. And this is a boss fight. Now I have to admit, it has been a while since uh, I've played this. And so basically I've got to get used to this. And I've got to really be careful because this could be a very tough boss. Now, where I've gone wrong is that I've started this without an actual power to use. So I'm thinking I should probably grab a power, you know? Bomb. Hmm. Is that really going to be enough? Let's see if perhaps there's a better option. Okay. I do kind of like that. Let's do this thing. Wish me luck. Because, uh, yeah. I'm not gonna say I have the best track record with, uh, boss fights. That I, I didn't even do any damage to it. But my assumption is I have to damage the, uh... Yeah, kind of like that. Except not really like that. I don't want to get hit with anything. But yeah, I admit it's been a while since I've played. I kind of have to get into uh, the swing of things. I don't think I can actually harm the robot hand. Uh, when it's doing that. But having said that, I don't know that there's... Oh, I got it. I got it. I hope this will be an easy boss. Ah, yes. Just stay low, Kirby. You'll be fine. Just continue to damage it consistently. And I don't remember if this boss has, like, two modes... I'm down to one life, though. But it is common in Kirby games to have bosses that kind of have, like, two, uh, attack modes. And I'm wondering if this boss will be the same, provided I get to that point, you know. Oh, that's unfortunate. So, I'm just gonna kind of play it safe for now. Okay, duck. Right? And then, when he does this thing, it'll be a lot easier to get some hit markers. Yeah, exactly. Okay, more rockets. So, my plan is to... I'm gonna try to finish this game. You know, no guarantees. Um, and it's not for a lack of interest. It's like literally who knows if I can beat the final boss, you know. I would hope to be able to, but I'm just not sure. But I will say that, yeah, I... I like this game a lot. Can I block it? Yes, I can block it. It's actually pretty useful. I'm a fan. Okay, I can actually hurt it too. Oh, but I can't avoid those. Okay, that's... that's good to know. Oh, I'm gonna need... 
gonna need all the health I can get for this part. Okay, so now we're moving on to the chase. Really intense. When I get a moment. Oh, I can damage it from a distance. That's good to know. Wait a minute, what's going on now? I'm kind of scared. Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to be behind it, honestly. <laughs> Ow, that hurt. Kirby, don't die. You're the only one left who can save the Star Kingdom or whatever you want to call it. Yes. And a hero is born. Good job, Kirby. Now we get this really nice cutscene. And... Is that the last planet? It probably is. I think everyone is pretty much ready for this moment. This feels like it's... The last act of the game. Ripple Star. It really does look like it's going to be a big level. I really... I like this place already though. It's nice. This, this power that Kirby has is really nice, too. Like, it's really effective. I can just go right through everyone. Pretty cool. Like, no one stands a chance. Nobody stands a chance here. And just like that, we got another crystal shard. Kirby is on a roll today, I would say. I like the uh, rainbow things and the spinning trees. Are those? Yeah, those are hashtags on a tree. Very unique, I would say. We got ourselves a boss. Um, Kirby is fighting a saw blade, everyone. Oh, I wish those things weren't flying in the air. Must get rid of it. Another crystal. Nice. I don't want to get hit by that fire. Yeah, this level is awesome. And fortunately, there's some food because uh, I do need some health rid of all these obstacles here. Yeah, there we go. Kirby is deadly. Don't mess with him. Don't underestimate what Kirby is capable of. That was a pretty, um, it's a pretty satisfying level, honestly. I quite enjoyed it. Ripple Star is a pretty, pretty nice area. Shall we go on to the next? Okay, this looks a little bit more, uh... Looks a little bit more threatening, you know? But... I'll take it. It's going to be another one of those water levels. So, um, believe it or not, this game is now available for Nintendo Switch. Uh, for those of you who may not have known, uh, I am playing the 20-year anniversary edition 
in which it, um, you know, it, it came on the Wii U, or the Wii, I guess. And I started playing on that because at the time it wasn't available on the Switch. But now this game is available on the Switch. The only problem is I've already started uh, on this edition of it. But from what I understand, there seemed to be some type of bug on the water levels um, that would basically make the game unplayable or it would basically lock you from making any progress. So fortunately, to this playthrough, we haven't had that problem. Um, and from the reading that I've done, especially on Reddit, it seems to me that it's just a problem of emulation. So, hopefully, for those who have the, you know, the the expansion pass, or, you know, the more expensive Nintendo plan, hopefully those issues can be fixed and resolved. Because, you know, these are older games, and they deserve a little more justice. You know, we can't have emulation errors on these, because, you know, we gotta preserve these older games. Because they were special, and they still are special. I thought there might have been something secret down there, but I guess not. Okay. Can you give me something? That is exactly what I need. Oh, there appears to be a one-up. Don't know how I get there. Don't know how I get there either. That's okay. I think... Oh, wait, I got it. Does that mean I can get through the other ones, too? No, maybe not. Well, I got the crystal shard. That's the main thing. What is this all about? Ooh, fancy, fancy. Wow. Wow. To me, that really felt like a short level. Um, let's try to go for the one-up. Maybe? Okay, fine. Ice cream. I'll take it. Alright. Well, everybody, this is a good stopping point. I hope that you enjoyed. And yes, I do plan to continue playing. I really want to beat this thing. I hope that I can. So, thank you for those of you who watch this, and I'll see you in another Kirby video. Goodbye.